you head to church to bend a knee. Now head to church and bend an elbow instead. Houses of prayer are getting blessed makeovers as bars and restaurants across the country. Our first stop, the Taco Guild in Phoenix, Arizona. This don't look like a Taco Bell. What makes the Taco Guild so special? We took an old church uh, built in 1893 and we converted it into a top-notch taco tequila bar. Did you keep anything from the original church still here in the restaurant? Absolutely. We've got uh, the pews from the church we left in, all the stained glasses original from the church. They traded a tabernacle for tequila a couple hundred bottles worth. Okay, so that makes baptism a completely <laughs> different thing. It does, okay. it does. Next, we head to Gross Point Park near Detroit, Michigan, where Atwater in the park is brewing up a good time in a holy place. The congregation had shrunk and they came to me and said, hey, how about putting a brewery in a church? And I said, are you guys crazy? Crazy like defrocks. Atwater Brewery took over the former Grace United Church and still brings the church vibes. The solid structure is very unique to churches. They built them with high ceilings and very thick and structured walls. And talk about sacred spirits. The Detroit Paranormal Expedition caught the possibility of ghosts lurking when they captured this light anomaly on camera in the basement. And finally, proceed to Urban Artifact in Cincinnati, Ohio to worship music. But The St. Patrick's Catholic Church Turncraft Brewery not only showcases arch ceilings, but live music most nights. In their tap room, enjoy their private label of assorted fruit and sour beers. Churches baptized into bars are across America. For everything that's new, now and next, go to thelisttv.com.